I could write Japanese so I could send a cute postcard to my friend here. Babe, but where does a ghost live? Stop lying, Miss Fortune. Ghosts are not real. You're just jealous because you don't have a ghost friend. Ah, look at those sweet blushes. They could be all my babies. Don't get too attached to those toys. Don't worry, I'm just looking. Wait, Miss Fortune. We don't know where the wolf is. Maybe we can find a map or something. To find the wolf, you say? Yes, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. There are coins at the bottom of the fountain. Yes, those are people's wishes. Can one pay for wishes? People nowadays think they can buy everything with money. I wish I could throw a coin and ask for my happiness back. Also, that Benjamin transform into a good foxy because I would totally go out on a date with him if he was good. Mm. Are you done here, Miss Fortune? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to point out where they are. There, you see? Pet the wolfie. Great job. Let's hurry up now. This looks like the way to the wolf. Yes, let's go then. Oh my. Looks like this area is closed to the public. Oh, damn it. You will have to sneak past the janitor to get to the other side. Don't let her see you. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mommy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. I could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm ready. Let's do this. Look, the bear in the picture? It's sucking a popsicle. <laughs> it looks like it's strawberry flavored. Mmm, yummy. Like a little ninja lady. Well done, Miss Fortune. Now, wait for her to turn her back to you and... And then kill her from behind? What? No. Why? That's what the ninjas yeah. do in movies. I've seen, like, all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well... This isn't a movie, so... Look a lot cooler on TV. Ah, oh, damn it, my ninja move failed. Oh. Oh, man, we got caught by the cops, busted by the law. We should get out of here and find the wolf. All right. Yeah, I'm sure this person will just let us leave. It says, safety rules? For handling the big bad wolf. If the wolf runs at you, ready to attack, then you shall not have any regrets about your life because you will most probably die. <laughs> so if I don't have regrets, the wolf will let me pet it? What? <laughs> no, that's totally how it works. So do you know? oh. oh no, we are locked inside. We need to find a key. Look around. All right. Maybe we can find a clue in the computer. Yeah, but it needs a password. I'll find it. I'll check those buckets. Mm, look, I found a paper with some numbers on it. Keep it. It might be helpful. Okay. 8945. Check out my computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep quiet. So five, four, six, eight. Oh, yeah. Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez is a computer scientist. You really surprise me. <laughs> a private shot. <laughs> Let's see what it says. Popsicle? Is that a code? <laughs> Talk about crazy. Code 27581. I'm taking a picture of that, so I'll forget. <clears throat> okay, I don't think I need it at the moment. I already have a lot. Thanks. Been much better today. How's the bear doing? Keep sucking that popsicle. Is that normal? I'm not sure, but I'd like to watch. Well, gotta go fix Calvin's cage. Oh, is that all that was on there? Oh, the safe! Huh, a secret inside? Fancy! Two... 
seven, five, eight, one. I'm so good at this game. Yes, I'm the best little ninja lady. I got the key. Well done, Miss Fortune. Very impressive. <laughs> Thank you. Let's leave. No key in sight, but you know, these boots are made for walking. And that's just what they'll do. Miss Fortune, focus. Okay, okay. Aw, I should have stole the boots. Time to find the wolf. And if we get lucky, I'll put it. We're not doing that. <gasps> wolf! Look! We found the wolf! Yes, and there's a note! It must say where the fox lives. We need to take it. I can reach it from here. See if you can get inside. Aw, oh, the bench says love yourself, cute. Hello. Are you Benjamin's cousin? You know, that fluffy fox with the most dearest big blue eyes? No? I don't know anyone called Johnny. Who's that? I'm talking about Benjamin. He's this sweet-looking fox that ended up stealing my happiness. I'm not that into him anymore. Maybe you should stop talking to him and find a way inside the cage, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, all right. It says, Canis Lupus, also known as the Big Bad Wolf. His favorite snack is... Red hooded little girls? That's silly. Remember the missing children? Mm-hmm. Maybe he's behind it all. You no. think he's eating the children? Who knows? <gasps> You're right. We should call the cops on him. No, we don't want to get involved with the police. Ah, uh, okay. Uh-huh, time to meet the wolf. This just does not feel like a good mm -hmm. idea at all. Come, Wolfie, come. <laughs> Let me pet you. I'm a nice person. I'm scared. <gasps> Wolfie? Ah, oh, damn it. What scared him away? Why can't a little lady just pet the wolf? Oh, that was unexpected. Not to me. Animals usually run away from me. That's too bad. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> My, this game is just so silly. It says, my evil cousin's address. Fox Skooks Tegan 15. Open fields. It's Benjamin's address. Good. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. Alright, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Are you telling me we are going to Phantasmagoria? It seems that way, yes. Sweet. I always wanted to go, yes! <laughs> Are you up for another round of questions while we walk? Sure, my question answering skills are all warm up. Great, great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? No. No, you mean this one? Yes, I have not heard that question before. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? I do it all the time in <laughs> school. Charlene still believes my daddy comes and picks me up after school. I as well behind the trees and sneak home when she's not watching. That's so sad. If you say so. Now. For the last question, have you ever seen someone die? I saw Grandad die. It was very calm. Not like in the movies, it was different. I told him to come haunt me as a ghost, but he hasn't done it yet. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting! Wow, this looks like the creepiest place to ever exist. So scary. I wish I had a ticket to ride, though. Really? But hey, what's that falling just in front of you? Mm -hmm. Please, don't play with my feelings. It can't be a ticket. Are you sure? It looks like a ticket to me. It can't be, but I'll check it out. Is that a skeleton? 
Scrapper. <laughs> what? A ticket for real? Sweet and spooky. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, Miss Fortune. Now, let's go find a boat to the fox, remember? Mm-hmm. <gasps> a ghost! Damn, that's Scrapper. Miss Fortune, please mind your language. But I got scared. It's totally understandable. Oh, That's true. Queen. No excuse. Keep it up. Okay. It says, Welcome to Phantasmagoria. Oh, thank you. <laughs> A creepy clown? That's creepy. <gasps> oh, balloons. I love balloons. We Just like so you earlier. know that I love balloons. <laughs> okay, Miss Fortune. He's like, I don't give up. Hey, you, from the other side, Miss Fortune deserves to have a fun time. So try to make the right choices for her, all right? I'll try. Hmm, I just have one ticket, so I can just ride one ride. I'm gonna look around first. All right. Hey, you know, once I saw a documentary on TV about hot dogs and now i don't want to eat hot dogs Boo! <coughs> sorry about that i was just trying to pull your leg if you do it one more time i'll just shut my eyes tight and see nothing this looks like benjamin but creepier and angrier check out those sweet unicorns is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on Not sure yet. I'm gonna look around more. The mean children at school say that I have a pumpkin head. I can see the resemblance. Oh, that's so the what? Nothing. Huh, okay. Ah, oh, the smell of freshly made candy is delightful. Ah, oh, yes. Too bad we can't afford any. Yeah, too bad. I'm like starving. Check this out. That is really something, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. That just did not feel necessary. Oh, sweet. That haunted house must be terrifying. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? I think this that probably will be the one I spend my ticket on, but I'm gonna keep looking first. Not sure yet. I'm gonna look around more. Before we leave, don't you want to use your ticket? Ah, yes, my ticket, of course. We'll use it on the haunted house. Yes. All right, then. Have a pleasant ride. Do we get to experience it? <gasps> Rock scene. Oh, I don't feel so good. I'm feeling this. Uh -oh. You think you're going to puke? I don't want to. But the ride went too fast. It was fun. All right, good. Take a deep breath and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good, good. Now, let's go find that boat. The boat? <sighs> okay, I'm okay. I already used my ticket. I can't ride this one. <laughs> Hit up? Bro sees dead people, that's so strange! Oh, there's a bunch of games here. Can I play one? Oh, of course. You must play one before we leave on the boat. I just love it here, don't you? <laughs> Who doesn't? <laughs> I want to play a game now. <laughs> oh, oh my god, all of these are about hurting Benjamin. Massacre? This one is free. I want to play it. Oh, please do play it. Play it as much as you want. Really? All right. Well, check this out. Now with real bullets. Fancy. <coughs> I, I think I broke the game. It looks like it. Oh. <coughs> this is fine. Check this out. I can get a reward ticket if I win. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. Please, go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about.
Oh, Are wait. these tiny foxes like Benjamin? They're dangerous foxes. Pretend they all stole your eternal happiness and whack them. Whack them! Okay. Damn it. Sorry. <laughs> Boing. <laughs> Oops. Hey. Yes, I won. Great whacking misfortune. Yay! Yeah, I'll get one more. I don't know what the reward tickets do, but... <laughs> Head down! I guess I'll stop playing now. I, I don't know what the reward tickets do, but I guess we'll find out. <gasps> Balloons! Mr. Voice, can I get a balloon? Because my mommy never gave me one. So maybe you can give me one. Well, you know we can't afford any, but look! What's that? A floating balloon! <laughs> Is it for me? Yes. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Ah, uh, here's my luck. Oh, Miss Fortune, I'm sorry about the balloon. Don't worry. Thank you anyway. <laughs> Sweet, a fortune teller. Can I try this? Yes, sir. Hello, I'm Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez, and I want to know the future of me. Please, thank you. <laughs> I say something bad. Once you see the beyond, the beyond sees you, and you can be sure it will be coming for you. <gasps> the beyond is coming for me? <laughs> What's the beyond? Want to try again? Eh. Nah. What's here? Check those sweet rewards! A golden chocolate coin, a cool tiny hat, and a doll. Oh, sweet. Let's see what I can get. Oh, I want all of these. So it looks like we're gonna have to go back. <laughs> I know who will look amazing in this tiny cool hat. Shut up! <laughs> there you go, Stony. You look like a rock star. Hey, we need to go back and play that game somewhere. I need four tickets. It's because Miss Fortune's hungry. Use that coin. And we want that doll. So hopefully it lets me play it again. Yay! Oh no, oh, I missed. No, I Damn miss. it. Cut down. Damn oh, very it. Good I didn't this. win. Well, you can try as many times as you want. Ah, okay. I've got to do better. <laughs> Come to slow. I suck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I have my four. Missable. I freaking love this game. Oh, one of those dolls again. I want it. Reality will transform into what the child desires the most. Oh, really? A desire, you say? I like desires. What did you choose? Nothing. That golden chocolate coin looks delicious. I'll take that. How I eat it. I got an achievement for buying everything. Do I have like... I don't think I have an inventory. Did I eat the chocolate? It says you need one golden coin to ride the boat. Huh, okay. Oh, I have that. It's chocolate, but I have it. That's terrifying. Shake this boat out. It's like a black swan. How cool is that? Really, really cool. Tell me about it. Anyway, this boat will take you where you need to go. You mean to Benjamin's house? Yes, and it's just one golden coin. I got the sweet chocolate coin reward. Is that good? I don't think that would... No, see, it's fine. Oh, look at that. Well, are you ready to leave? This is going to be so cool! I hope we don't get attacked by pirates, though. <laughs> now, why would that happen? the Kraken. What's a Kraken? Well, if you see it, you'll know. But tell me, I'm curious now. We don't have time for that, Misfortune. Just forget it. Ugh, but now I'll think about it forever. Oh, ah, Kraken! If you appear in front of me, I will see you, and if I see you, I will know it is you. 
I guess I won't be betting the gray gun. Oh! <laughs> Was that the fish from the bridge? <laughs> I think he's happy because I saved him. You remember I saved him from the bridge, remember? Yes, I remember. Did you see the kiss he gave me? <laughs> On my mouth? Because he was in love with me. Because I saved him. <laughs> Somebody loves me. Hey, Mysterious. Are you taking me now to the house of Benjamin? You know, that blue-eyed, soft, fluffy fox who happens to be a great artist and stole my happiness? You don't seem to want to talk about it. And why is that you collect coins? That's how you pay for your rent and food, right? Miss Fortune, just leave him alone. Ma, he wants to hear. Anyway, do you like to eat sushi? I know about sushi because I have a Japanese ghost friend. By the way, can you speak Japanese? I need some translations. Do you know what this means? Kiriba doku desu ka? So you don't know, huh? You know, I've never been outside this late by myself. Do you go outside by yourself this late every day? Are you going to eat my chocolate coin? Because I'm a bit hungry. Ah, uh, stop talking! Ah, why should I stop talking? Nobody else is talking. Hey, Mysterious, so where are you going? Oh no, can he swim? Hello? That's what happens when little ladies ask too many questions. It makes people want to drown themselves. Ah, stop it. I'm pretty sure he'll be fine. Look, we have arrived. That's nuts. Oh my god. Game's insane. What time is it? It's getting really dark. Mr. Voice, are you there? Hello? There's something wrong here. Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? It's coming. Hide. Hide. I don't know what you're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. Hate up? Ugh. Where am I supposed to hide? <laughs> Check this out, Stony. This is your family, see? From the woods. Say hello. And now, say bye-bye, baby Stony, because we're leaving. It's the monster, Mr. Voice. Can you see? Can you see it? <gasps> Leave me alone. Run. What are you running away from? <laughs> Is it the fox? I'm pretty sure it was the fox. No, it's the monster. I saw it again. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I saw it. What is don't he doing? Don't make any sudden moves. Don't touch her with your filthy paws, you beast. Stop it. You're scaring him away. Don't leave, Benjamin. I thought we were supposed to hide. Please, Why did that not happen? Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt. And I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me. He's dangerous. Stop running, please. Uh-oh. What's this? Really? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, you'll end up hurt. Uh-huh. I know I could have been more specific, like, there's a bear trap up ahead, stop or you will be hurt. But I felt like getting straight to the point. Okay, okay, thank you. Who left a bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox also. I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. <laughs> All right. Oh, this makes me think about Bubsy, you know? Did, did I show you Bubsy the teddy in the secret spot? 
He will be very sad to know about this, you know? These bear traps. Because he's a teddy bear. He lives in a world of fantasy where there are no bear traps. And if he will go in the woods, he will see this and not know he's dying. Now I see Babsy being killed by a bear trap. That's how it is now. He's dead. Babsy died. What are you talking about? About Babsy, don't you listen? Let's keep going now, Miss Fortune. Bye, Babsy. Trap dead in the bear trap. What is bloody yapping about? This one looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> it's stuck. Huh. The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really? Interesting. Okay, I don't need it again. Hey, another doll. The games you enjoy, you can have them all. Oh, nice. Games! What are you doing? Nothing. So. Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? Yes, yes, I do. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. And in my secret spot, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magical, don't you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, it is, my sweet child. Moving on, second question. Do you trust me? I guess. I can only hear you in my head. And I trust my own head, so yeah. That makes me so happy to hear, Miss Fortune. Well, anyway. Now, for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? Yes. I am. I don't know if I will like being dead. It's like, too mysterious, you know? What if I can't bring my glitter? Well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know? That's a little lady. Hey, look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure the fox has hidden the eternal happiness here. Make sure the cabin is empty, and if you see the fox, run. All right. Be brave, Miss Fortune. You've got this, little lady. Okay, I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share that prize with us, and everything will be fine. No, if we see Benjamin, we run. That's what the voice said. Is this Benjamin's? He got some sweet style. I like it. Whoa, a video player. Fonsu! Oh, are we using it? So. Let's see. <gasps> Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. Maybe I can fix it. I wonder if this is like everything that's happening. Happiness to the video player! <laughs> like a dream of misfortunes. Okay. I thought I might have like actually fixed it, but mm. I didn't. What a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? I'm just gonna have a little look inside. <laughs> Benjamin! Julianus Red Fox. By Benjamin Johannalius Red I Fox. I don't think I pronounced I knew his there. name was Benjamin. Wait, real? So Benjamin is not from open fields? I bet he has an accent. I love that in a fox. 
I must make dangerous mission. Mission must be done is what I trained to make nervous, but it's okay. I have study and bigger confidence. I travel from the Cerner City to Pandora. When fog appears, I pack things and food. No information on how long stay. I rent cabin until work done. My task important. Boss told me many victims in town. I need courage. After a long walk in fog, I arrived at a city called Open Fields. Tiny town has good forest. Cabin very nice. Has TV, kitchen, I sleep sofa. I decorate cabin. Fish balls smell funny. Ate mushrooms in woods. I refresh after sleep. Try find parasite. Did not find it. Day one fail. Parasite. Parasite, you say? Many victims gone missing in parasite game. I can't help. Feel sad. I send message to boss. Some victims not coming to Sinner City. I see parasite. It scared me. Also, not eat more mushrooms. Stomach ache and much gas is no good. Don't eat this mushroom again. Hi. Um, we're playing Little Misfortune. Very cute, sad, funny story game. Who are the victims? What game? Benji's afraid of the parasite. So Benjamin's not a bad guy? Well, no, but he's working with the parasite, so maybe. Mushroom, serious danger, not feel good danger. Mushroom, I stay home, cut wood and do tea and root soup, good taste. I do dolls for victim and pictures if she sees them good. So are we a victim? Parasite recognize Morgo code, whatever. It likes to play, it has guide for steps. Courage tomorrow, not rest until stomach good. Or now rest until stomach good. Let me take a picture of that code. I don't know if it'll be important later, but I'll have it just in case. Oh, poor Benji. Feeling no stomach aches, only gas. I go help missing victims in town. Morgo know I'm here. Morgo play old trick many times now, but it make a mistake. One victim can hear its voice inside her head. Is Mr. Voice the monster? The victim code misfortune is nice code. Morgo can't have her say boss. She must be rescued, but I follow steps. I saw Morgo take shape scary. Hmm. Missing a voice? It's the monster! Boss, send me message. Watch victim house. I sleep outside house. That explains it. Uh, hide in trash. I fell. Find parasite. Did not come today. Big trouble. Misfortune. Watch me. Strange. Why she see me? She big eyes. I run away. Felt warm in stomach. Maybe mushrooms tickle again. Why? I don't- I don't know how I feel about misfortune and the fox. Like... Okay. Big trouble? Misfortune? But that's me. I bet he's in love with me. I see Morgo play old trick again. Victim didn't realize all is again, all is again. Must courage and stop parasite this time. I send many victims to sinners today. I got level two protector. I confident. Now I has Prameve Illumination Cane. All my again? Oh, shake out Benji stick. I try Prameve Illumination Cane in woods. Fun. I feel courage. Practicing to help misfortune. I see she makes too much talk. I think she's fun and strong. Morgo confused by charms of misfortune. I did video picking wood and parasite came, but I'm courage now. I scared only little. Hmm. Yes, I know how to talk. He loves me. <laughs> I message boss, I'm doing it today, all steps followed, prepared breakfast tea, funny feeling with tea, herbs from woods are fun, I'm courage and confident today, I ready? Ready for what? If Benji has a boss, he has a job, then I can be married to him. It looks like Benjamin likes to educate himself, the I like that of love. <laughs> When hatred wants to be loved. The fun stories of a boring man, the upside of being a spirit animal, communication, key to cooperation, learning how to be gray, death after life. Oh, I was kind of hoping I'd start dancing. Mmm, that tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blonde. Because I can almost smell his boss blending the ingredients. 
Maybe I should try it out. Hmm, Mr. Boy said that I shouldn't trust a fox. Look at that. Benjamin looks so pretty in that hat. <laughs> Oh. <gasps> Benjamin! I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Your diary. I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it the monster in your diary you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. You can't hide the children. I knew it, the voice is the monster. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? Like if I was a girl in trouble? <laughs> Why do I keep falling? Benjamin, where do you go? This is scary. Oh no, is this Benjamin? He died already? What? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? Can I climb through that? I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. Don't worry, madam. There's a stool. Uh-huh. Such a clever little lady. Time to use my ninja skills. Your ninja skills are awful and you will probably fall. Shh! Oh. What a bad crack! Be quiet! This is a ninja mission! What is going on? Benjamin, are you here? So it was Benjamin placing these. But Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. That's what I'm thinking. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. Huh, it's locked. Hmm, I wonder if there's a key behind the painting with a key. No, yeah, this is very strange. Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. Hmm, wow, I, I, I wonder if there's My a key there. My senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Hmm, a real ninja lady always touches everything. <laughs> a secret button. All right, then. I push the button. Okay. That's interesting. That was easy. All right. Time to find Benji. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> I hope things get better and I get the eternal happiness. Oh my god. Okay, Miss Fortune. Let's finish oh. this. Get up, Miss Fortune. Oh, wait, why am I struggling to get up? You are stronger than you think. Yeah, you are. Did you let that stop you? Come on, Miss Fortune. Come on, we've got this. Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. I believe in you. Because. Because. You are the little lady, Miss Fortune! Yes, you are. <laughs> okay, I'm out oh, again. Dear. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Mr. Voice is bad. We no longer listen to Mr. Voice. Mr. Voice is the monster. Oh, a baby deer. So sweet. Oh. Mm, dream come true. I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> <gasps> what happened to Benjamin? Is that Benjamin's bag? Benjamin? Are you around? He must be in trouble. 
I'm very disappointed in you, Miss Fortune. Ah, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please, stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time and that's very sucky. I trusted you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. You're the one taking the children. And I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that. Then play with me. You need to find your eternal so happiness. Mm. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What inside? Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. <gasps> baby Benjamin. <gasps> is that Benjamin as a baby? <laughs> so cute. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. A deal, you say? Uh oh. Oh, this is really mysterious. For students at the University of Sina Studies Technology, protect your course three step guide to exterminate parasitic beings from the beyond. Introduction. As the ultra reality forms in hand with the concept of time, new realms outside the constituted free have appeared. After the ultra war, thousands of beings were discovered as byproducts of the war they created themselves a new realm we refer to as the beyond the beyond is in simple terms a place of extreme absurdity with no logical laws of physics we can't allow such beings inside the free at the moment since the foundation of our reality is based on the energetic and ethical values of the ultra reality before the ultra war the beyond is still a misunderstood realm we haven't yet found the pieces to connect with it in a logical manner the few patterns we recognize are the behaviors of some visitors also known as parasites they normally enter the third reality, aka Pandora, and seek fresh meat to lure into the beyond. And that's why we need the protectors. The protectors are the only ones with the capability of seeing the imbalance between realities and using the tools available inside the ultra reality. Protectors will help victims and guide them into serenity. The guidance provided in this book must be followed with great responsibility. Never skip a step. For each victim, the protector returns to serenity. The protector will be rewarded with new levels, tools, and more steps to follow. The parasite. Step one: the protector must locate the victims in the parasite. Protectors, parasite case, more go. Evaluate if the victim is in need of assistance. If so, then proceed to step two: need of assistance checklist. The victim seems to have forgotten his or her identity. The victim's already dead, but doesn't realize it. The victim believes the illusions of the beyond are real. The victim sympathizes with the parasite. Misfortune, I think, maybe fits with number three. Okay, checklist of parasite. Deforms reality into absurdity. Parasite seems friendly, yet it lures the victim to play dangerous games. Ugh, it shapes just into a human animal creature. Quickly learns about the environment, language, and culture are not an issue for this parasite. Large flocks of black birds will appear near the parasite. That explains the crows. These birds are the eyes of Morgo, giving him an overview of his playing ground. Use the surroundings to help the victim become aware of the parasite. Oh, so that's what Benjamin was doing. Okay, he's a protector. The protector can, for example, write and paint simple messages in public spaces to increase awareness. It is strictly forbidden to interact directly with the victim. It could lead to irreversible trauma inside the victim's mind. If the parasite kills the victim, you will need to proceed to step through immediately. Paint? I like to paint. Step three. Prepare for direct. Ooh. With the what? Now I will never know. The victim, maybe? Am I dead? Surely not. I feel like it's misfortune dead. Was he hiding or oh. 
So Benjamin really right. does want to help Miss Fortune. I guess I'll take the train back home. Oh, uh, we don't have the money for a ticket, Bibs. Now when I look at this, I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. He knew all along. Such a foxy boy. Okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting for a little while. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. <laughs> oh? So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Oh, okay, I have not what this, I thought she like, meant by that. where are they? I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin. And now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> <laughs> you go, girl. Hero. Yay, coloring book. I wonder what the importance of Hero is. I feel like he's important. Oh, I can color. Oh, we're coloring. Oh, this is so... Oh, oh, wait. Hold on. Okay, this is awesome. Big fan of this. This is awesome. Very glad we took the coloring book with us. God, I love this game! I'm, I feel aggressively about this game. But it's a good aggression. Now, how is this green crayon making everything or making things that aren't, you know? I, I tried to, I tried to say a sentence and then it just did not work out. So are we really, are we really about to like get home safe and sound or? You know what I noticed? The girl next to Riley looks a lot like Riley. Wait, that's so creepy. What? That is like, that's kind of terrifying. Do we look, d wait, ew, wait, why do we look so similar? That is scary. Oh my god, what? Oh, I'm in the game. They ripped me into the game. That, that's kind of, that's, that's creepy. I'm glad you pointed that out. Wait, why do we look, we look, ah, we look so much alike. It's kind of awesome though. You know, they didn't, like, pay me. They put me in the game, and I got no commission. Like, what the frick? That's- that's weird, man. His toes, these are red. Who painted them red? Oh my god. So true, dinosaur. Beat toxic masculinity. No, I'm not- I'm not done- game, I'm not done coloring. I must keep coloring. I'm finishing this. I can't. I gotta finish what I started. I'm sure you understand. Oh, oh my god, what if I like miss my stop because I'm coloring? Oh well. Worth. I'm a big fan of this. Surely I get an achievement for completing the painting, right? Or the coloring? Like I probably would. No achievement. <gasps> oh, there's more. This is so incredibly awesome. I know. Listen, I know these coloring books probably don't impact the game or the story at all in any way ever, but I must do them. I don't understand. Someone could literally make a game of just this, and I would probably play it, I'll be honest. I wonder if there's more after this one. <gasps> there is. I am I feel like, you know, there's gotta be consequences to this. Like, I'm probably gonna miss my stop or something because I'm coloring, but I don't care. This is relaxing, and it's nice, and I'm enjoying it. And I will be putting my happiness first and foremost. Thank you very much. It seems as though I found the strat to completing these. So that is good. 
Yeah, what are you thinking of the game so far? Because I am adoring it. I probably get an achievement for coloring all the things, so. I kind of want it in the pages. Huh, I don't feel inspired. Hello, Hiro. I didn't recognize you. Hm. Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? I know Hira. What does it mean? It's the monster! Leave Hira alone! I probably Hira, should have covered my, my eyes. I get to see Hiro again. I wonder what that monster did to him. Oh, head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. Oh. Benjamin was warning me all the time, but I couldn't see it. I wanted that eternal happiness so bad. I'm a silly little lady. That's what I am. Oh. Like, this is like a metaphor for life. At least I had fun at Phantasmagoria. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mommy about it. Maybe don't do that. She might be upset. Ugh. Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. Maybe she is, like, dead, you know? I can't see her. That was fast. Uh oh, the black crows are here. Huh, where's the car? Is Daddy gone again? Oh, did they go searching for her? That doesn't seem good. We got red lights. I like them. Mommy, I'm back. Hello? What's that sound? Bangy? Bangy, what happened here? Congratulations, you reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good, good. Ready for a new game? If I play alone, will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will, but only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. Dylan, just... Are you starting over? <laughs> this is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not-so-wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! Uh, eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to... Wait. What? No deal. No. No. Uh, how <laughs> about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure. Sure. I promise. You know the way. Well... If Mr. Voice scares me again, I'm gonna run and hide in here. I have a little hunch that Mr. Voice is the monster in my closet. Okay, I'm just gonna play his game one last time.
Not the best idea. Oh no, not again. You promised he wouldn't be like last time. That was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. New game. Knock, knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock, knock. Who's there? You're scaring me, stupid. Leave me alone. What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Huh, Stomly? Teach me how to be brave. So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right, just so you know. My game is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your lies? I will live forever with Benjamin, and there's nothing you can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been trying to take you away from me all the time, and his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. <coughs> you silly little child. Another toy for my collection. You're mine to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. You'll see, Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. Why alone? <laughs> Benjamin! <laughs> Get his get ass. There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. <laughs> yeah, Benjamin! <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> no. No! Yeah, Benjamin! I'm confused in my heart. Is everything back to normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? Benjamin, did you go outside? Benjamin might be in trouble. Morgo is coming. Open your eyes. He's the voice in your head driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Can I just, like, go back to sleep? I guess I have to rebuild this. I'll make some improvements. But first, I want to find Benjamin. Why can't we just let it go? Benjamin? Where are you? Oh, yeah. Ugh. Talk about cause and effect. Ugh. Ugh. Benji? Where is the mother? October a lot is still the same day. Mommy. Oh no. Is our dad dead? Mommy. I'm back. Mommy, don't ignore me. Are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you? Or maybe she is dead. And that's what the policeman is. What's happening? Mommy? <laughs> this must be a bad dream. 
I don't know what's going on, but I'm sad. Wait, who is that? <gasps> That's us. We did die. Crossing the street, I guess. Maybe? Is that... Oh no, what have I done? I knew crossing that street was a bad idea. Called it. Dude, I... Oh, Bengi, you're back. I thought I, I lost you too. No. What's this? What? What's happening? We need to go? Alright. Where are we going? Oh, okay. Bengi, wait. Are you taking me somewhere else? Because I have nothing against it, but I have to talk with my mommy first. You can't talk with her. She's... Or we're dead. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Bangi, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. I guess I was your little misfortune for a while. But you need to find your own happiness now. I love you forever. Is this the beyond? I miss when this game was just funny. Now it's all sad. Wait, stop, Benjamin. Where are we going? Bangy? I like his bag. <gasps> oh, puppy! I'm so happy to see you again. Wait for me, puppy. Puppy is dead. Oh. Which means we are also likely, or we are dead. Is this the afterlife? Oh, I'm confused and sad. <laughs> Airborne. Oh. Right, that guy was kind of cool. Where are we going? This place is really cold. Did I miss two things to glitter? Is that why I'm not the whole tree lit up? All around disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog, you defeat him. Mm. Huh. I guess Mr. Boy's game is over now. Benji? Who are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. What is this place? I got an achievement that says somewhere else win the game. That's it? I won, I guess? I'm confused. I'm very confused, but I loved it. Loved this game. Love, 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 loved this game. The art, the story, just everything I loved. The story could have been more clear, I think, because I'm still left confused and we are still pretty lost. Wow. Wow. That was a great game. That was a- I loved it. I loved it. Highly recommend. Um, I would play through it again with, like, the different choices and stuff, because I'm sure- I'm sure there's multiple endings. Um, I mean, because I got an achievement for winning the game, so I'm sure there's probably one for losing the game, and I wouldn't be surprised if there's more- just such a good game. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Standing ovation, except I'm sitting. <laughs> that was beautiful. Yeah, very beautifully made. Ciao. Are there any other games like this that you'd like to see me play? Please let me know. If you know of any games like this, yeah, let me know because 
this is incredible and I'd love to play more games like this. Kill Monday games. I'm gonna look into them and see what other games I have. I loved this. Wonderful game. Oh, dude, I'll never get over how good this game is. I'm so glad I've decided to play more like story games and things like this. Wait, I can continue? Pause. Wait, what happens if I click continue? Oh no, it just puts me at the last save. Okay.